Tesla announced that it has broken ground on a new facility called Megafactory in Lathrop, California. It will be used to produce Megapacks, Tesla's biggest batteries for stationary energy storage. As of now, Tesla exclusively produces its battery packs for its energy division, Powerwall, Powerpacks, and Megapacks, at Gigafactory Nevada. However, it appears that the company will now expand production to California. Welcome to Tesla Today, where we talk about the latest news and exciting things Tesla is doing to accelerate the world's transition to sustainable energy. Please subscribe, like, and share our videos. It shows your appreciation for the work we put in here and motivates us to make new videos. Today, we will be talking about Tesla's first megafactory ever. Sunny Dollywall, mayor of Lathrop, announced the new Tesla megafactory on Wednesday. He wrote, quote, We are proud to be the home of the megafactory, Tesla's most recent expansion here. The future of green energy will be produced right here in our community. This development means more prosperity for our city, more employment opportunities for our residents, and a brighter future for our planet. End of quote. He shared some pictures of a groundbreaking ceremony on Facebook that confirmed the new factory will produce Megapacks. Almost exactly two years ago, Tesla launched the Megapack. It was Tesla's third stationary energy storage product after the Powerwall and Powerpack. A single Megapack unit is a container-sized 3 megawatt-hours battery system with integrated modules, inverters, and thermal systems. With the bigger size and integrated power electronics, Tesla claims that the Megapack is 60% more energy-dense than its Powerpack. It also comes on-site ready to install and can ship in containers. The battery system quickly became extremely popular to deploy large-scale energy storage projects like a battery project replacing a gas peaker in Ventura County and a huge 1 gigawatt hour project in Northern California. It's interesting that Tesla is now expanding to Lathrop to produce the new battery packs. Tesla has long used warehouses in Northern California City to house logistic operations. According to Tesla's 10 KSEC filing, the company owns a 500,000 square FT building in Lathrop, which is about an hour east of Fremont Factory and it has long-term leases on at least three more buildings for a total of over 1 million SQFT of floor space in the city of about 23,000 people. The company also took over a new 870,000 square FT building in 2019. It's now evident that Tesla has taken the first step to mass-producing megapacks by breaking ground on a new type of factory, a megafactory. This is great news for Tesla and its energy customers, as megapacks are in high demand. Once Tesla can mass-produce megapacks at a faster clip, we could see Tesla Energy become just as successful as its automotive side. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. In the meantime, if you want to see more about the innovations Tesla is putting in place to make the world a better place, please subscribe to the channel.